Now I'm gonna do the same thing, scroll the track number three right there. And I'm gonna add some auxiliary percussion. Right there you can see my shaker, so if I hit record and play, Do another record, I'm on track number four now. Um, now I'm gonna add some other samples. So I'm gonna hit mode and I'm gonna hit PD11. And it brings up the sample bank. Uh, I didn't add any samples to any of these pads up here. As you hear, there's nothing happening. So I'm gonna go ahead and search for some music sounding samples that maybe I can layer. So searching through the samples that they give you with the MPC, I found four samples that I'm okay with using as somewhat of a melody over the top. We've got guitar one, guitar two, we've got a clap that's in stereo, which sounds okay. And then I've got this uh, weird chimes thing which i'm not sure what i'm going to do with yet but i figure i'll use it i've also taken the time if you notice i'll press the main menu and slowed my bpms down to 85 because it sounded like this guitar and that guitar were recorded at 85 so my beats a little bit slower now but it lines up okay with the guitar pieces that i've chosen so we've got the regular beat. I'm gonna scroll down here and add a track number five for the melody. And I'm gonna go ahead and hit record. Now let's add a little bit of clap to that. You can get to the save menu by pressing the mode followed by pad number three. So I recommend to any beginner users that you scroll through to the save entire memory section. Otherwise, you may or may not save what you intended to save. If you save the entire memory, then all your programs and your sequences and everything are put together along with the samples in a nice folder so you can find them again. And that's probably the best way to go until you get more advanced and understand what parts of the songs you want to save and what parts you want to keep. So that's about as basic as I can get. Um, that's the real easy version of using your MPC. That should get you started. I'm not very happy with this beat, it's not great. It's using the basic samples that you get with your MPC so everybody can make something like this really easy right out of the chute. Uh, once you get more advanced, you'll start finding your own samples and find that these aren't gonna satisfy your needs. You're always gonna wanna be on the search for new samples. If you need any samples or you need any help getting started, just send me an email. I'm more than happy to help. Thanks for watching.